Plasma weapons have captured the imagination of both scientists and science fiction enthusiasts for decades. These weapons, which harness the power of ionized gas or plasma, offer a glimpse into a futuristic battlefield where energy rather than traditional munitions reigns supreme. Nearly 30 years ago, deep within the classified corridors of Los Alamos National Laboratory, researchers conducted an experiment that still captivates the imagination of scientists and enthusiasts alike. In this groundbreaking test a newly developed high-energy laser was fired at a piece of leather specially chosen for its similarity to human skin. The laser pulse lasting only a few microseconds emitted an extraordinarily bright flash that filled the room, and in an instant, the leather burst apart as if struck by an explosive projectile. This astonishing demonstration offered a rare glimpse into the potential of directed energy weapons and set the stage for decades of research into plasma-based armaments. Plasma weapons have long been a staple of science fiction, conjuring images of futuristic battlefields and energy projectiles. However, experiments like the one at Los Alamos suggest that the seeds of this technology were sown long ago. By channeling a concentrated burst of laser energy into a target, researchers were able to generate conditions where matter is rapidly heated, ionized, and transformed into plasma. This process, though fleeting, measured in mere microseconds, reveals the tremendous power harnessed within modern laser systems. The experiment not only demonstrated the destructive capability of such a weapon, but also hinted at its potential for precision and control, characteristics that have driven further research into directed energy systems across the globe. Since that seminal test, scientists around the world have been intrigued by the idea of developing a weapon that uses energy, rather than traditional munitions. The concept of a plasma weapon involves generating a stream or ball of ionized gas, plasma, that can be directed at a target. In theory, such a weapon could offer unprecedented accuracy and adaptability. Its ability to produce a focused burst of energy means that it might be used to disable electronic systems, cut through armor, or even create a localized explosion without the need for chemical propellants. Despite these promising attributes, Plasma weapons remain largely experimental, confined to research labs and classified programs. One of the most fascinating aspects of the Los Alamos experiment was its demonstration of energy delivery in an extremely controlled manner. The laser's pulse, lasting only a few microseconds, managed to convert the target material into plasma almost instantaneously. This rapid transition highlights both the potential and the challenges of working with such high-energy systems. The precision required to generate, control and apply such energy in a practical setting is immense. Researchers have since continued to refine laser and plasma technologies, striving to overcome hurdles related to power supply, beam coherence and cooling systems, issues that must be addressed before any plasma weapon could become a reality on the modern battlefield. Beyond the immediate shock value of the experiment, its implications extend into the broader field of directed energy research. The demonstration at Los Alamos underscored the possibility of developing non-kinetic weapons that rely on energy rather than traditional projectiles. Such systems could, in theory, provide military forces with tools that are both versatile and less prone to collateral damage compared to conventional explosives. In a world where precision is paramount and the risk of unintended consequences is high, the allure of a weapon capable of delivering a controlled burst of energy is undeniable. While plasma weapons remain in the realm of experimental technology, their potential applications have spurred further investigation into various forms of directed energy systems. Modern research continues to explore how these systems might be used not only in offensive capacities but also for defensive measures, such as neutralizing incoming threats or disabling enemy electronics. The Los Alamos test, with its dramatic display of laser-induced plasma formation, serves as a powerful reminder of the untapped potential that lies within advanced energy technologies. Today, as technological advancements accelerate, the line between science fiction and scientific reality becomes increasingly blurred. Although plasma weapons have not yet been deployed in any conventional military arsenal, the ongoing research in this field suggests that we may one day witness the emergence of directed energy systems that can perform tasks once thought impossible. The journey from a classified experiment in a high-security laboratory to a fully operational military system is fraught with technical challenges and ethical considerations, but the progress made over the past three decades is a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of innovation. 
In this video, we will delve deeper into the history and science behind plasma weapons, examining not only the famous Los Alamos experiment, but also the ongoing global efforts to harness directed energy for military applications. We'll explore how lasers and plasma interact with matter, discuss the technical hurdles that researchers continue to face, and consider what the future might hold for this mysterious and potent technology. Join us as we unpack the science, history, and potential future of plasma weapons, a topic that blends cutting-edge technology with the timeless allure of the unknown. Whether you're a science enthusiast, a technology buff, or simply curious about the latest advances in military research, this exploration promises to shed light on one of the most intriguing subjects of modern defense innovation. Stay tuned as we journey into the world of high-energy lasers and plasma physics, uncovering the secrets behind what many call the most mysterious weapon in the world. 